My university comes up with weird things sometimes. Yeah. So the day has come and I'm finally going to see Fightstar, my favorite band. And I could just spend a lot of time talking about how excited I am. But just to make it short, I've never been excited about a concert as much as today. So I just can't wait. It's gonna be awesome. I didn't record what I thought about the show after it because I was just so overwhelmed. But that honestly was the best gig ever. It's the best concert that I ever went to. It was really amazing. And actually, after that, I got to meet the band. Well, not the whole band. I got to meet Charlie and Dan, which are the main vocalist and the bassist. It was just so amazing. I didn't get a chance to take a picture with them, but we chatted a little bit. And they were really nice. They're really cool guys. So that was just amazing. And here's some footage from the show. Okay, so Nick is here. And we're at the venue already. And it's just like a, such an awesome venue. There's a balcony. Here I am in Leicester Square again, where all of a sudden, all of this appeared. I didn't see this before and it wasn't here before. There was the premiere of The Hobbit right there. I, I don't know if you can see behind the trees, but the premiere of The Hobbit was there and all the, like, the cast just walked right beside that building. And there is the official M&M's shop, which is the worst place for me to go because I love candy. And it's actually pretty expensive to buy candy there. By the way, there is snow. London has some gigantic snow. I don't know if I ever mentioned that. So a fellow YouTuber and a science nerd, Charles Trippi, uh, in one of his last videos, he did the science experiment. So this is something called uh, hydrophobic sand, and I'm gonna show you what it does. <laughs> okay, look. Look at that.
Oh. It looks kind of gross when it's underwater. Yeah. So basically the sand is like, it has some hydrophobic compound, which basically makes the sand go like this. And the most awesome thing about it is that look, when I grab it and I put it up, wait, when I grab it and I put it up, what does it feel like? It's dry. Exactly. So this is just like a little science experiment because I really like all that kind of stuff. And if you try to pour some water on the sand, look what happens. More. See, the sand is holding it. The water doesn't go down. Because science is awesome. I feel like I can just do this all day. So if any of you guys have some suggestions or ideas about like science experiments that are fun, just let me know in the comments and I'll try to do something. Hee <laughs> hee. So we are going to the airport right now because it's the last day of leaving. And uh, we got more going with luggage. Yeah, I got my guitar and like this little bag. And also we got, a, we got this big bag, which we think is overweight. And the airline allows like only, I think, 23 kilograms. So we don't really know what we're gonna do with that, but uh, we'll see. So we just decided to use the tube to go to the airport. We're flying from Heathrow. We finally arrived at the airport. Uh, we used the tube and it took us about an hour, I think, to get here, maybe a bit more. But it's a, basically it's a pretty convenient way to travel to the airport, if you're going to Heathrow at least. It's a good way to travel and it's cheap, it's, it's the cheapest way. So we did end up uh, having a overweight luggage, so we had to buy another bag because... <laughs> now we are looking for somewhere to eat because we're really hungry and there's like an hour until the boarding. And Nick is just like devastated because there's no Burger King or McDonald's. And uh, yeah, he's having a hard time. Okay, so we're in the airplane right now. I got a little bit sick in the last couple of days. Uh, <laughs> the last couple of years. <laughs> we're ready to take off. And uh, I just want to say thanks for everyone who's been watching again. I even uh, got like a few personal messages, not like even comments under the videos, but like personal messages and they were pretty long where people just said how much they love the videos and just all kinds of crazy, amazing stuff. So <laughs> thanks to that people also. The last three months we had the most amazing time in London. I got to meet my favorite band, I got to meet my favorite musician. I got to meet a lot of cool people at the university uh, and it's just been really fun and especially to think about that it's already been three months since we came here. They just flew by so fast and like all the things that we learned after we started to live like without parents and stuff like that compared to the beginning when none of us even knew how to use a washing machine any last words <laughs> <laughs> I, I, <laughs> okay that's he, he doesn't talk much because he's not very good at it so that's all right thank you very much for watching thank you for everything see you in a month and have a good christmas holidays mm -hmm.